Hello ladies and welcome to my kitchen. So today I wanted to make a yummy pumpkin tea latte. And for this, really all you're going to need is some kind of flavored pumpkin tea. I have one that I got from Tivana and it's their flavored oolong pumpkin spice brulee. So that's the one I'm going to be using and I'll just show it to you. Right here. I have already filled my mug halfway with milk and I'm kind of warming that up in the microwave. You can warm it up stovetop, it's up to you. If you like sweetness, have some type of sugar or honey. I have a little frother here. I also have a bit of amaretto that I'm going to put on my latte. My little frother and what I'm going to be steeping my tea. And of course the milk that I, uh, milk of choice, which I warmed up, or am warming up right now. So I'm just going to put a spoon, a little spoonful of tea in here. I don't need too much because um, I'm not going to be filling it up all the way. I'm only going to do like half the mug of tea. So I've already boiled some water. And I'm just going to go halfway here. I'm going to let it steep for maybe two minutes. Like, yeah. By the time I froth and everything. So I'm going to go and grab my tea now. I mean, sorry, my milk now. And here it is. And what I'm going to do is just put it in the, the little frother. I'm going to do this over the sink. I'm going to grab my frother and while I do that I'm going to also grab my honey. I'm going to put a little bit of honey in the mug. I'm using raw honey so it tends to be a little bit more solid. Okay. Put that away and wipe my hand. And I'm going to grab my frother. This is a frother that I got from Amazon. It's really cute and it's battery operated. And I'm going to froth. Let me see if I can tilt this. No, I cannot really tilt this. Can I kind of tilt it? Hmm. Can get a little crazy in here, so okay. So I'm gonna do definitely just pour. You guys can see it's already starting to froth. I'm gonna pour a bit into my mug. I'm gonna froth them more so it's easier for you guys to see it frothing. Hard. It's gonna spill. And I kind of just froth near the top, you know. Wow, this looks good. Look at that. I'm gonna pour a little more. I'm gonna froth a bit more. I really like a lot of froth. And this is just a really good way if you're trying to get some milk in you, which is what I'm trying to do, you know, because you can really add a good amount of uh, milk. Let's see, let's put some of this in here now. And I'm 
gonna just grab more of this frothy goodness. Let's see if I can show this to you. I'm gonna just try and get that honey in there to melt. Put more of this yummy frothy goodness on top. And I'm going to put a little bit of amaretto, because why not? And a little bit of cinnamon. This little thing I got from Disney, by the way. And voila, you have yourself a delicious tea latte. This is all to taste, so if you don't want as much milk, obviously put more tea. If you like your tea a little bit more concentrated, uh, you could leave it, let it steep a little bit longer or put two spoons full. Um, it is up to you, and you have a delicious, yummy um, drink that's pretty overall relatively, it's healthy. I mean, it's got some milk in it. Um, and it's, you know, it's a type of tea instead of coffee, so it's a lot healthier than the alternative uh, pumpkin spice latte that we all love from Starbucks. Alright guys, uh, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.